guys, it's BD Steve 2 for the 8th Making Yu-Gi-Oh! video. Now, first of all, I want to say thank you so much, Galactic God, for letting me be on your channel. Um, you've been absolutely awesome to me. You're one of my very, very first, uh, I think, 100 subscribers when I made my very first video, which I topped UK Nationals uh, with Junk Doppel a while back ago, about a year and a half, two years ago now. Uh, you, you supported my channel, and also, you know, I said you were one of my very first subscribers, so thank you very much. And ever since then, you've always supported me and gave me advice. So, guys, if you don't know who I am, I'm Speedy Steve 2448. I do lots of videos based around Junk Doppel, based around Quick draw plants based around uh, Sylveons and based around flower princesses. Anything that's plant orientated, anything that's very very fast synchro summoning. Um, I basically do the competition there too. I also top nationals once again two times a year in a row. Last year with Fire Fist as well. So um, I've only been you go for you go for about three years, um, and for the past two years I've top nationals. So the reason I'm here, guys, is I want to show you guys my version of a synchron deck. I know Galactic God recently did his, and I want to show you mine as well. Um, it's focusing a bit more on Quasar than I usually would do. So let's go to the deck profile and go over some of the key cards and how we do make Quasar and make all synchro summoning goodness so let's get into deck profile guys all together we have 24 monsters with three junk synchron two quick draw synchron two doppel warrior two level eater two unknown synchron two synchron explorer one cobalt hedgehog and one genx ally birdman two raiko and one lila for the hand traps we have one maxi two effect veiler one gauze one chaos sorcerer and one BS. So some of the key cards really, um, like I usually have for most of my deck profiles, I have a pure engine of three, two, 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 two. I always love this engine. This engine here of uh, your your synchro monsters and then your support monsters and then two single level one tuners. I really love that engine. It always helps me get into my plays very, very often. The combination of these four cards in particular give you so many plays and give you Quasar, give you Shooting Star, give you lots of bits and bobs depending on what you need to go into in that scenario. Two single Explorer just really, really useful. Obviously it helps you with that free card combo with Quasar, but generally it's just a really decent card because we do have uh, five, six, seven targets over here. One Cobalt Hedgehog, I usually play two, but sometimes one's really useful just because you can, if you play Forest Barrel, you can just ditch one to the graveyard and go from there. Genesis Island Birdman, just lots of little plays, basically. If you summon Junk Synchron, bring back a Doppel Warrior. You can then bounce Junk Synchron to back to your hand and special summon Genesis Birdman. It's the exact same scenario, level three Synchro Dark Monster as well. So you can even go stuff to like your Dark Diviners if you are going to play them. Um, and the great thing is you put this back in your hands for the next turn. Your Lights 1 engine, just the milling is important. They're also the light targets for our Chaos engine as well. Raikou is a really useful card. Pops those annoying cards like e your Evil Swarm Monsters. And Lila as well, popping those back rows, are additional MSTs. Single Maxi, Maxi isn't the greatest at the moment. Some decks is very dead, some decks is amazing. So one at the moment is pretty useful. Great thing about Maxi as well, works very well with this deck simply because you can ditch Maxi in your own turn just simply because then you can summon Junk Synchron and bring Maxi back so you can go into a level five. So even if you're not even special summoning to your opponent's turn, it's just a decent way to get level five out. Two effect Veiler, just a useful card all round. Also, it's very good at level one tuner because you play one for one in this deck. And then we have our three big boss monsters in Gauze. We play no back row at all. Uh, Chaos also and BLS because we do have a fair amount of the Chaos engine. Onto the spells, we play all of our searches in free tuning, one uh, Reinforce of the Army, one Charge of the Light Brigade, one Fordish Burial, and one One for One. So all of these guys here basically add cards to your hands, put them from the field, stick them in your graveyard. They're basically the way we get all of these cards set up to make our huge combo plays. Then for speed and pure draw, uh, draw power, we have one Lord of Darkness, two Part of Dicotomy, uh, free upstart goblin so really just lots and lots of draw power and speed to combo to get into these cards much quicker and get to our combo pieces much quicker and then to find off we have two mystical space typhoons and one dark hole and we play no traps at all because we're very fast and we don't like to set so their msts are dead which is very useful for us so all together guys a 40 card deck the extra deck is formula synchron miss bird armory arm junk warrior librarian catasta junk gardener behismuth black rose Berserker, Road Warrior, Stardust Dragon, Scrap Dragon, Shooting Star Dragon, and Shooting Quasar Dragon. Now, for you guys who don't know, in Europe and in the UK, Shooting Quasar Dragon isn't legal. So usually, rather than Shooting Quasar Dragon, I do play Dark Diviner, who I definitely recommend, because Level Eater and Quick Draw Synchron make him, so also with Birdman as well, and he's incredibly, incredibly useful. So the spells, uh, extra deck, and the monsters all there, guys, for 40 card deck and 15 extra. Onto the side deck really quickly. I haven't done a full side deck, but basically you basically want lots of back row destruction. So Catastrophe and, and additional MST, very, very useful. Also cards like Royal Decree are very useful against quite a few decks at the moment. XYZ Encore is really useful against your Evil Swarm decks. And then we course have free DNA surgery, which is good against so many decks at the moment. And then finally, we also have some, some additional Synchron monsters in. And like I mentioned, Crimson Blader, you can take out Scrap Dragon 4 against Mermels. And also stuff like Decisive Armor, really 
really useful card. Um, you can take out a uh, shooting star dragon and put it in for decks like against Bujins. And also, like I mentioned, Dark Diviner for my Quasar. Dark Diviner wouldn't usually be in my side deck, and the two cards that would make up the remaining 15 cards would be Shared Rides. Um, Mistake's a really amazing card, and I prefer Mistake in most decks, but in this deck, you do add cards to your hand a fair amount over here. So I would prefer Miss, uh, I prefer Shared Ride over Mistake in this deck. So if you can get your hands on two Shared Rides, which I haven't got my hands on just yet, um, I definitely would recommend playing them. So guys, hope you enjoyed the deck profile. Uh, just a really quick one. Um, if you want more content like this, go over to my channel. As I said, I do lots of videos like this. Usually at least once a week, I put up a Junk Doppel, a Quick Draw Plants, a some form of Synchro Summoning awesomeness on my channel. And once again, thanks a lot, Galactic God, for letting me be on your channel. I do appreciate you and all your support, buddy. All right, thanks a lot for watching, guys. Be Steve 2448. Play something expected, and I'll see you guys real soon.